Hi kids today we have the last story from the land of fart series the story is about the traveling letter z let's read the story the story traveling letter z is written by daniel erico illustrated by magico case the letter z lived in the land of farts he traveled all over the world he saw the lava pit of punctuation he swam down the waterfall of words he even slid down the ancient slabby slide one day he set off to travel further than he ever had before he walked through the jungle and out past the plains he walked beyond the snowing mountains and through the green pasture then he came upon a village a sign read the land of numbers he had heard about the land of numbers but never been there before as he walked through the streets all the numbers closed their windows and doors they did not like letters and did not trust the letter z a group of dollar signs came by and told him that the king wanted to see him they brought him to the castle to see king ten what are you doing in my land asked king ten i am the traveling letter z he said and i came upon your kingdom by accident king ten was not convinced you are a spy from the land of words said king ten you must be here to steal our lord's diamond from us so that the letters will have it the letter z had never heard of such a diamond before and he was certainly not a thief throw him in the prison said king ten the traveling letter z had to think quickly wait i would not steal your diamond In our kingdom we already have the most impressive diamond ever made. The king was very curious. He did not like the idea of the letters having a better diamond. How can you be sure that it is better until you see yours? said the king. He brought the letter Z into a special room with the large diamond inside. King Ten was very proud of the diamond. The letter Z inspected it very carefully and said, "Hmm, this is a fake diamond." King Ten could not believe his ears. He ordered all of the dollar sign out of the room. "How did you know that it was fake?" he asked the letter Z. I did not know it before but now I do. And if you don't let me go I will tell everyone in your kingdom. The king was very angry. He had no choice but to let the letter go. On his way back through the village the letter Z saw all of the others numbers outside their houses. We heard you were a spy they said. I'm not a spy. I came here because I like to travel. Your king accused me for no reason. He said back, "I like to travel too." At the number 5. Then the king excuses everyone of being a spy. Said the number 3. They all talked for a long while. The numbers even invited the letter Z to stay. for a feast and everyone do like him by the time he left they were quite good friends when it was time to go he thanked them for their kindness and started the long road back home from that day on he always told all of the other letters how nice the numbers of numbers land were You know kids what is the moral of the story friends come in all shapes and sizes 
Hope you like the video. Please do subscribe our channel. See you again. Stay blessed.